What's going on guys, Multigales HD here, as most of you guys probably already know. So guys, in this video today I want to go ahead and give you guys an in-depth review for Destiny. Now I did this in the beta and a lot of people ended up enjoying it, so I figured, you know, what better way could I do this than break down every single step of Destiny and tell you guys what I thought of each way along the way. So here is my breakdown. Now the Destiny, the graphics are stunning, like I said in my uh, first impressions. The game is visually amazing, you know, I find it very, very hard to believe that we have kind of Xbox One graphics on the Xbox 360. There isn't very much of a big difference on this game, no matter what console you play on, and that shows that they did the job right, you know, if you play Xbox One, you get a little bit better, but it's nothing like Grand Theft Auto V where, you know, the grass and then the grass on the Xbox One look completely different. It's not the case like that and they've really done a really nice job coding it on every one of the consoles and it's amazing to think that this game took only six years to make. You know, I know six years is a very long period of time to make a game but this game kinda seems like, you know, it should have taken ten with the amount of work and the amount of map and every single thing on here. I just think that the game should have taken a little bit more time but it's amazing that they were able to pull this off in such a short period of time. Now, Let's go ahead and go to the sound. The sound actually has a couple problems online currently. It is November 11th at the time I am making this video, so it is subject to change, but currently in the game right now, there's a couple bugs that if you're playing multiplayer, it doesn't really happen so much in story mode, but if you're playing multiplayer occasionally, your audio will completely just drop out, and you'll have a period of time where you won't have audio for, let's say, 15 to 20 seconds, and then it'll come back as normal. Um, you know, I think a lot of the problems is, is the hardware on the Xbox 360. I haven't heard many people saying that this is happening on the Xbox One, but for the Xbox 360 at least, if you're going to get it on the Xbox 360, you know, you might want to be a little bit wary of uh, audio drops. But I'd say once an hour you probably get those. So it isn't a huge deal, but the audio I'm going to go ahead and give 10 out of 10, you know? It's a stunning, amazing graphics, and then you have an amazing audio system, and if you have a good headset or good stereo, you're gonna absolutely love this game. Multiplayer is very, very amazing on this game. I'm gonna go ahead and give it a 10 out of 10. The only flaw is that right now, there's a big, big level gap, you know? I, I don't wanna make it sound like multiplayer is completely bad right now, because it's really not. But there is a lot of games where I'm level 20 in the game right now, and I'm going around facing level 5s and lower. And that kind of concerns me because I love being on that side of the upper, you know, advantage on other people. But at the same time, I see a lot of people coming and playing Destiny for the first time. And then they get into a lobby with somebody that's been playing it or is more experienced than them. And it kind of, you know, swings them away from not playing multiplayer because of them not being the same skill base or the same level or not having the same play time. And that's kind of discouraging if you're going to be a newer player on the game. Hopefully that this skill gap disappears over time with skill-based matchmaking on Destiny. And hopefully the people that are higher level right now will only play higher levels in the future because of skill-based matchmaking. We can only hope, but I assume that's going to be the case. Story mode is a 10 out of 10 out of all the campaigns I've played. There's only been one single campaign on another game that has been better than this. That was GTA 5 but it comes very, very close to second, you know? It reminds me of the original Halo game campaigns. It has that same feel with the sound effects, the amazing length of the campaign. It's a very, very fun thing to do on a weekend, you know? You and a couple friends get together and go ahead and just completely just camp out the campaign or grind out the campaign and just go ahead and finish it in a weekend with a couple of friends. That's what I personally did, and I loved every single second of it. I definitely recommend playing the campaign, not solo, but with a couple of other friends. It makes it a lot more enjoyable. But like I said, that is a 10 out of 10. Overall, Destiny has blown by my expectations. A lot of people said this was going to be like Titanfall and not last very long. Absolutely not the case, you know? Titanfall lasted very, very short time, probably about a week span. I see Destiny going for years. I don't see any reason of why people would leave Destiny. It's an amazing game environment, the community is great, and they have a great support. That is what you need for a good game to last, and Destiny has everything of that list. So like I said guys, Destiny is an amazing, amazing, amazing game. I definitely recommend if you guys don't have it going out and picking it up right now. It's definitely worth the money. Like I said, I've played a lot of games on Xbox and this one is definitely my favorite of all time for right now. 
So like I said, it's definitely worth buying. It is an amazing game. Make sure to go out and buy it now. You don't usually ever hear that from any of my games worth buying, but this is definitely one of those times. Anyways guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys could hit the like rating, comment, and subscribe. Until next time guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm Multi Kills HD, and I'm out. Peace.